Hey guys, welcome back to NextGen Blog. And in this video, I want to show you how you can perform Bezier curve transition in BSTC Video Editor Pro version. Now, it's actually super easy to perform Bezier curve transitions in BSTC Pro. So, without further delay, let's get started and see how you can do this. Now, to demonstrate this, I've already imported two demo videos in the editor. So this is my first demo video and this is my second demo video. And as you can see right here, I've overlapped both my videos by one second in the timeline like this. Now, Bezier curve is not a transition in itself. It is an option which is present in each and every transition which is there in the VSDC editor. So to demonstrate it, first I would like to add any transition between these two videos. So let's say let's add a wipe transition. So double click on your first demo video. Now go to video effects, go to transitions, select wipe and now click on OK. Now look inside the wipe settings which is present inside the properties window and inside type currently door is selected. So let me just change this from door to side. Inside mode currently right to left is selected. So change this from right to left to left to right. Directly is set to false, so that's fine. Inside gradient length, currently the value is 50%. So delete this value and instead of 50, write 0. And now press enter on the keyboard. And so now if I just quickly play the video for you. So this is a normal wipe transition from left to right. Alright. So this is a normal wipe transition from left to right. Now, what we are going to do is we will use the Bezier curve option to make this transition a little more animated. So, what you need to do is inside the wipe settings, you will find this option called transition levels, where currently the values are 0, semicolon, 100. So, you need to click on this three dots which is present on the extreme right of the transition levels option. And the moment you click on these three dots, this graph is going to open up right here. Now, as you can see, the graph is pretty linear. So it is starting from 0% and it is ending at 100%. So it is a linear graph from 0 to 100. And what we are going to do is we will add curves to this graph. So first, you need to select this option right here, which says parameter change along a Bezier curve. So there are a couple of options present right here. This is constant parameter value. This is linear parameter change and then so on and so forth. But the final option is this one parameter change along a Bezier curve. So you need to select this option. Now what you need to do is you need to add points along your graph. So let me just double click right here and add a point. And now you can manipulate this point according to your taste. So I have made some changes right here. Let me just add another point right here. And let me make a couple of changes right here as well. Like this. And let me add a third point right here and let me once again make some changes right here like this and so now if I just quickly play the video for you perfect so let me just play this thing for you once again so now instead of a linear transition we have more of a curved transition all right Perfect. So you can modify this thing by playing along the graph. So I can change this point from here to here. I can bring this point down like this. And so once again, if I just quickly play this video for you from the start. So this is how you can actually use the Bezier curve option inside every transition to animate your transition a little more and to add a little bit of, you know, spunk in the transitions.
perfect so this is how you can actually perform bezier curve transitions in bscc video editor pro version do let me know your thoughts in the coming section below like the video and subscribe to my youtube channel i will again see you in the next video till then thanks for watching